And I know every day when you go out and get on the court, three things happen, okay? The coaches teach, you learn, and then you apply it on the court. That's really the, the, that's really the secret sauce to having a great team. And so what you have to understand is like, intensity and hard work is just, that's not, that's just the price of admission in this league. That doesn't win you games. You guys have a chance to be in the top 20. You'll be in the top 25 this year if everything goes according to the way I think the coaches coach you. Now it's real, and you can't waste days, okay? I'm excited to be here. I wish you all the best of luck. Let's have a great practice today. Thank you. I usually, I like to wake up two hours before practice. Just get my body going in the morning, get up, take my dog out in the morning. You know, I'm a kid from New York City, far away from here, all the way on the East Coast. And one thing I can say though, I've never been homesick. I'm not that type of guy. Uh, I am a mama's boy, so I call my mom two to three times a day. Today's my birthday. My mom would text me. I think I'm about to give her a call. Hey, Ma. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> nah, I'm good, ma. May God continue to bless you and protect you, man. Thank you, mama. I appreciate that. So what's that? What's, what's the plan? Nothing. I'm actually getting recorded right now. Look. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, that's my boy right there right now. Happy birthday to you. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Love right. you too. All right, my love. Love you today. All right, love buddy. You. Bye, buddy. So yeah, that's usually my morning routine. Call my mom. Good high five. There we go. Bye, mom. I'll see you later. Yeah, so I usually do that every every morning before I leave. Uh, I leave this light on for her too, just so she's not in the dark. All right, it's time to go. It's been fun, um, you know, I'm happy that I'm here. I'm happy I chose here. And also just playing with my new teammates, um, figuring out, um, you know, what they what they do. Um, still figuring them out. You know, I got here about two months ago. Um, you know, so I'm still trying to figure out um, what these guys do, where they like the ball at, and um, things like that. Coach always preaches to us, you know, the more you come closer together um, and be closer together and play for each other and, and things like that, just, just – Having a winning mentality, that would just go a long way, you know. Um, and I, I just feel like, you know, not even talking about basketball, it would just prepare us for life and relationships after basketball. So I feel like um, just winning, you know, having that winning mentality, uh, playing for your teammate um, and fighting hard every 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 single game, every single minute until the buzzer blows, you know, do anything we could do to win uh, the basketball game. Right now I'm about to go get dressed. Come back out on the court, talk to the guys, shoot around a little bit, get ready for practice. Man, today we're at the park, man, getting flicked up. Y'all see it, man. Great feet song. <laughs> yeah, Here media day, crazy. man. You know, we're gonna walk around, you know, just have fun with the guys. Yeah, you feel me? Something light, something light. The drip is something man. real smooth. I, if I got the memo we was wearing our chains, I would have popped out with some, but nobody it's wanted fine, to tell it's me. Fine. Peep the haircut, though. You know. Just peep the retwist, though. I just talk about the retwist. He got the hair. I just peep the retwist. Oh, he's Hollywood. He's Hollywood. Mr. Jersey himself. Where are you going? <laughs> don't listen to him. He dribbles too city. much. Boogie down, don't listen to him. From the city. Not a vibe. Three, two, one, action! Man, a little intro video. Looks pretty exciting, actually. The fire behind the guys seems 
like a great effect until you feel the actual heat if you get too close to it. Alarming the first time it happened to me, but uh, you know, this is what's fun. When you get the whole team together and you get to see them interact in a way uh, that they enjoy and it doesn't have anything to do with basketball. I think the funniest part was when I walked up, they're like, oh, coach is here. <laughs> well, maybe not quite that devastating, but we're in the middle of practices, getting ready. We need to play somebody else. That's this time of year. Intro video night though, cool time together. Man, welcome to where the Mount of Magic happens. This is the office of the general manager of Texas Tech men's basketball. Um, day to day stuff in here, watching film, you know, making phone calls to recruits and parents and things like that. Spend a lot of time with this thing right here. A very, very important piece of what I do. This is my own personal crystal ball. This ball has a very special story. Been with me since I started in basketball. If you look close enough in that thing, you can see that the future of the Red Raiders is tremendous. Let's take a tour around the office. These guys, look at these, get, get these guys. Game planning, this is part of our war room. We have some of the best these are the best GAs in the country right here. Getting us, getting us squared away for what's to come next. I can't tell you guys how excited I am to be a part of this Red Raider family and this community, man. It's, it's been a special place for me and my family so far. Um, can't wait to get out there and play in front of the United Supermarkets Arena and get, get really going in front of our fans and stuff. Record. Kellen Buffington, AKA Buff, is like the expert in how to help people grow and to see their full potential and what that looks like every day. And he lives it by who he is as a person, but he also can identify it as what fits best for our team. And I just think he's uniquely qualified to be the best GM in college basketball. Yeah, Kellen Buffington, that's a good dude right there. He's been very supportive on the side. He's been instilling confidence in me as well as the team. You're going to see right now who the best shooter in the country, these two right here. I got my money on Pop Isaac and Chance McMillan. We, we locked in now. Here we go. Here we go. This is after a two and a half hour practice right here. Dedication for these guys. I love it. Good practice today, man. You feel me? Back at it again tomorrow. <laughs> 